Well, my name is JL Treeb, and I own a photography studio called Artistic Images by JL in Brookings. I'm a very visual person. I like to be creative, and I also am a big people person. I love working with people, so just the chance to be able to work with all different types of people, especially the personalities when things are they're usually in a good mood, weddings, senior portraits, that kind of stuff. It's a really fun time in life, and so I get to work with people and that kind of thing. Um, yeah, the people aspect of it and the creativity. And um, I think that we all are able to work well together because we all have a very a very different style, and so we're all catering to a different group of clients. And so even though photography in general, port photography is a very saturated mark, there are a lot of photographers, but I think that if you can successfully brand yourself and have a really unique look, it's really, there, I think there's definitely enough clientele for everyone. When I started out, it was really cheap, just because that's kind of was the thing I thought, well, I could do nice portrait photography and be affordable, but then that the best way to brand yourself is not by being affordable or by being cheap. So what I try to do now is focus more on the unique aspect of it and the quality of it and kind of stay away from really telling people about the pricing as much, like that being the first quality. But as far as picking a pricing structure, I basically just kind of try to look at prices in the area and try to at least be competitive, not really short, you know, underselling myself, but not being way more expensive. And that's the cool thing about photography is that I've, through a few conventions that I've done, more like internationally, I've met a lot of photographers from just all over the country, and which is really neat because we can share ideas and not feel like, am I helping the competition or whatever? So that's been really neat. Um, there's a couple of photographers in Watertown that I work with a lot. We kind of refer to each other if, say, if I'm booked for a wedding, I'll tell people to call her, vice versa. But it's nice to be able to bounce ideas off somebody that's kind of specialized in the same thing. The way that my photography is, it's a very candid, personality-driven style, so every session is different. I really try to, for one thing, I always ask that my clients come in and do a consultation before their session so that I can just kind of ask them questions about, well, first of all, what they want to get from their photos, what style they like, but also just about what kinds of things they're interested in, their personalities, and then I try to go from there. But somebody else had asked me what I like the best, like if it's weddings or seniors or kids, and I really do like aspects of all of them. But I think what's probably what are the easiest subjects are people who are very or very confident and know what they want, what they're looking for, or very organized. But at the same time as that's fun, I also really enjoy taking someone who's maybe a little less self-confident and has never really liked portraits of themselves and to be able to really show them some beautiful work and make them enjoy it. The thing I like most about all, all parts of it, you know, whether that be weddings or kids, is I really like candid style where I don't have to spend as much time per se posing the people, but really just capturing them in, in things that they're doing. And really, I feel like that way I can get a lot more of the emotion, a lot more of the personality, and have it not be so posed. That's really what people enjoy to see, too. So